My name is Kevin Sackle. Uh, I'm a senior at Stony Brook, uh, and I study math and physics, I'm majoring in math and physics, and I'm minoring in music. So I became interested in mathematics actually um, when I was really young. I sort of wanted to build roller coasters for a while, but when I was going into ninth grade, I went to a math camp uh, by the name of MathPath, and I learned this very simple proof, sort of a, a two-line proof that there are infinitely many primes. And to me, it was extremely rewarding. I mean, it was, it was incredibly quick, incredibly elegant, and I sort of fell in love with math from, from that experience. So since then, I've, I've always wanted to do math. There's a really strong mathematics undergrad community here, and it's great to see it's great to see that, and it's great to know that I've been a part of that too. The mathematics of high school and the mathematics of college are somewhat different. So uh, in college it starts to become this very interconnected form. You start learning about all sorts of things and everything becomes more intuitive. It's not about manipulating equations, it's not about these, these T-bar proofs, it's about writing logical statements that make sense and that are rigorous and that prove something that you expect to happen. I've also taken lots of music classes on the symphony. Uh, professor uh, David Lawton, who I thought was a very good professor, and, and would show artwork sometimes during the class to, to reflect the style of the, of the period. And it would be, one day would be an art class, and the next day would, it would go back to being a music class. I thought that was really, really cool. I received a Churchill Scholarship. It's essentially a scholarship that is given out to 14 people uh, nationally every year to take part in study uh, overseas at Cambridge University in the United Kingdom for STEM fields. Um, so I got it for mathematics uh, and I'll be studying mathematics uh, over at Cambridge doing part three of the Mathematical Tripos. It's a fairly historical program and it should be a lot of fun.